Okay, hey everybody. Here we go. We got a uh, the uh, blue kale back there growing good for the microgreens, or not really. It's baby greens now. And there's the uh, oh, what is that? The black seeded Simpson. Another black seeded Simpson. Some more black seeded Simpson. And mung bean sprouts that have taken off and some black seeded Simpsons on the other side and down here we got blue kale pot choy and some black seeded Simpson combination some plants are overgrowing others it's becoming a problem I think I planted my plants too close together I believe I should have separated them about maybe six inches apart as opposed to I think I did them about two or three inches apart. I wouldn't expect them to grow this big. But live and learn, right? Anyway, and down here we got some more growing. Got some that pak choy leaf at the bottom's not doing real good over there, but I don't know what that is. It's not the ladybugs eating it. Anyway, here we are. So, that's how easy it is to grow. I haven't done anything to it, but check the water every now and then and refill it when it needs it. And I've got the automatic water on that one right now. Could be why that, that plant's dying. Anyway, it is the easiest way to grow that I've seen with the hydroponics no pumps needed no electricity except for the lights and they're all LEDs so they don't cost much to run and this is where we're at everybody have a good day